the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's law. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 20, Exodus 5-7 Three-day offering as a negotiation tool. The negotiation between Moses who returned to Egypt and Pharaoh began and God showed his power through miracles. First point. After 40 years, Moses opens up the issue of his people. When the Hebrews were suffering as slaves, Moses lived in the palace until one day he ended up killing an Egyptian who was abusing one of his people. And so Moses had to flee as a murderer. At this time, Moses knew just how sensitive this matter was which led him to run away. Fast forward 40 years, Moses returned to the ever-sensitive issue, but this time he made a loud statement. Second point. To Pharaoh, Moses did not ask for wages for his people, but rather a three-day trip to the desert. When Pharaoh said yes to meeting Moses after 40 years, Moses may have realized at the point that God had made him the prince of Egypt precisely for this occasion. If Moses did not have the previous prince title, then the chances of a parallel meeting him would have been zero. When they finally met after 40 years, Moses did not ask for wages or for anything else. He instead asked for him and his people to leave Egypt for three days to go to the desert to make an offering to God. Moses added that God may kill the Hebrew nation if they did not go. Third point, Pharaoh says, I do not know your God, and furthermore banned the Hebrews from leaving Egypt. Pharaoh tells Moses, I do not know your God. Indeed, Pharaoh ends up paying the price for this as he and the Egyptians come to learn who God is. The Egyptians added the work of the Hebrew nation and made their labor even harder to endure. This made the Hebrews express a grudge towards Aaron and Moses. Fourth point. Moses and Pharaoh start their six months negotiation. Negotiation is very different from begging. Negotiation is about bringing a sizable deal to the table. Moses' card was God's miracles. To this, Pharaoh responded with his civilization. Fifth point. God, who used the Nile River for the purpose of entering Egypt, once again uses it for the Exodus. Joseph successfully led his family into Egypt by producing excellent results through the seven years of abundance and the seven years of famine. At the heart of this success was the Nile River. The Nile brought incredible abundance to Egypt. God, 400 years later, once again uses the Nile River, but this time for the first negotiation for the Exodus. God turned the Nile River into blood. Pharaoh, however, hit back with the civilization. Pharaoh was confident that his people could find other ways to get water. Instead, he turned and went into his palace and did not take even this to heart. And all the Egyptians dug along the Nile to get drinking water, because they could not drink the water of the river. The Egyptians were able to get drinking water by digging around the river Nile. It may have appeared that Pharaoh overcame God's miracle with his civilization, but what Pharaoh did not know was that God's warning 
was actually an opportunity. This selfish action by Paro meant that God would send more plagues to Egypt. This Tong Doc app is amazing. When I first met Dr. Zhou, we were speaking together at a conference. And when I saw the Tong Bible and the way he had placed this one story together, the Bible, one story, I ordered cases of this Bible. Now to see this app, the Tong Doc app, ready for you to use in your daily Bibles reading, this is amazing because so many people tell me I don't understand the Bible. And he has placed it in an order as so that it is one story. And then day after day, takes you through the Bible in a way that God's Word will touch your heart so deeply that it changes your beliefs. It helps you to rise up and be the amazing person He created you to be. Welcome to the Tong Dog app.